Oi, what's up everybody? It's Mr. Buggles. I'm bringing you another review and rotation video on centaurs. I really like this area, but I do find that there's a lot of spots where there's pretty much no mobs, so I thought that this would be a helpful video to help you guys out. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe if you like this kind of content, and I'll be sure to release more videos like this in the future. Alright, without further ado, let's get right into it. So first things first, I would recommend getting any kind of potions, buffs, food, or outfits you have to increase your combat experience. Don't forget to go to Awaki Toshi to pick up your Marnie Stones. So in this case, we want to grab the Centaurus. So next, I'm just going to go over what it drops here. So go into your menu, go to Adventure, Item Drop, and then it's called Taftar Plains or something like that. Taftar Plains? Taftar Plain. It's a plain Taftar Plain. So you go into here, as you can see it drops the Rokaba Helm, Centaurus Belt which is really good because it's pretty, it's 10 million on the market, it's not bad. These gems are really valuable as well. You can see it's 3.5, 6 million, 3.4 million, 3.6 million, 3.5 million, so it's pretty good. Also I would like to note that there are a couple quests right at this area that uh, you can see it's called Hazard. So if you go in the map and go find that that person on the map, you'll be able to find a couple quests here to gain a significant chunk of XP. And I really like to start in this little top zone right over here. And I'll show you two different rotations in this video. So the first rotation starts at where my person is, right up at the top. And then go around these trees and you'll see two big mobs. And pretty much you just keep zigzagging along this area. And, and you'll see mob to mob the whole way. You just keep zigzagging. And then on the way back, I really like to go up a tiny bit and you'll see a big mob here and you'll see in the video where the where you start going up and you just pretty much zigzag your way along here until you get back to the trees. And by the time you're back at the trees, the mobs will be respawned and you can just redo this rotation. So this is one of my favorites to do. It is important to note that this is probably the area that has the least like these two red circles probably have the least amount of mobs but it's pretty much just traversing around the circle and then my next favorite is coming all the way up here going up this uh mountain area you'll see a little area you can climb up on this side and then from here you want to grab the big mob right here and even right behind there is a pretty big mob and then you go up the mountain you keep going up and you'll be able to find big mobs along the way until you get to pretty much the peak of the mountain get that big mob there and then jump down that little slope and you'll find another big mob and another big mob and then from there you'll be able to restart the rotation because the mobs that were near the bottom of the mountain are, will be respawned by then. Just like the last rotation I'd say that the least amount of centaurs are around this area uh, there's a ton in these trees on, along the way and then there's probably another slow spot right in between here but that's just you pretty much traversing to the other side of the mountain. So yeah, these are my two favorite rotations for centaurs.
Thanks for watching this video, everybody. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Have a great day, guys. Cheers.